It looks like the chat window is working. Hello, everybody. It is I. It's a bit dark in here. Let me turn on the lights. I'm very happy, eyeball. Uh, what do people normally do in this point? Oh, well, I am Lubar of the Void. Uh, you could just call me Lubar. So I have a thing here detailing some things about me. PNG one. Oh, oh, that's a bit. <laughs> <laughs> I am a Voidling who came to this realm of Earth 25 years ago. I have grown enamored by the all the different media and video games here, so I immediately got addicted. Sorry, this is a bit of a scuffed stream already. I I started the stream, and I immediately forgot what I was supposed to say. So there's that. My height in the void, I can be whatever size I want. I can be this large. I normally choose a height of two feet, about this I'm about this tall. Technically, I am taller than you, but on average, you are taller than me. Anyways, I said I was a voidling male. He, him, I guess. Is that what pe is that what the cool kids say nowadays? Small, impatible voidling. Thank you, I think. Intelligence, I have plus 10, but that is crippled by my one wisdom. That means I cannot apply any of the knowledge that I have. Can the voidling bing bong one shot a mob? You're going to get the boys. Who's, who are the boys? Are they good boys? Are they bad boys? Are they good? Bad? Lubar interests. Now, this is something I can talk about a bit more. So, starting left to right, I have games where my favorite game of all time is Undertale slash the Deltarune series. You're going to see that on the uh, channel, it's, uh, on the uh, Twitch channel at some point. Other kind of game genres I like is the action and deck builder roguelikes, uh, One Step from Eden, Slay the Spire, and Dead Cells. And I also like Metroidvanias, Hollow Knight, uh, Bloodstain, Curse of the Moon, Momodora, and Dead Cells. <laughs> and the two gacha games I play are Epic Seven and Blue Archive as a recent. And my hobbies, I might have mentioned earlier, uh, D&D 5e is my favorite thing to do as a forever dm being a dm feeds into the world building creative writing making stuff basically my hobbies consist of video games and uh D, &D. <laughs> do i play rhythm games i'm not good at rhythm games so i don't really play them <laughs> uh music instrumentals and high quality riffs any of you familiar with siva gunner uh i listen to them a lot I own pretty much every album they have, and my music taste is trash. Granddad, I want to create a D&D &D world with the viewers. We are going to create a map. And from there, we're going to drop some flags of who lives where, uh, what environments they live in, and we're just going to world build. And eventually, we're going to use that world to run a D&D &D campaign with a group of other VTubers that I can hold in a room for three hours at a time, at least maybe twice a month. Third thing, I want to play games that are less mainstream. I, I see a lot of people, there, there's nothing wrong with people who play Genshin Impact. It's a really fun game. Uh, Genshin Impact, Halo Infinite, like all the new stuff, all the easy content stuff to go through. But I'm going to be playing a bunch of games you probably never heard about. And uh, fourth one, stream full-time as an occupation. Basically, uh, earn enough to uh, please my family that this is okay to do. My fifth thing is I hopefully make it on to uh, the Weary 101. If any of you are familiar with VTuber Takahata, he is one of my favorite streamers to watch. And that, that community, I really do want to be a part of it. And four, ah, here's my creators. Uh, this is Retta. He made me. And uh, Smooth Shading was the guy who made me glow, made me move. Uh, he set up all these emotions that I can, uh, I can show you. I can be sad. I can be angry. Also, hi, Retta. 
Love you. <laughs> Love you, Dad. And slide number five. Lubar's people, he'd like to thank because they are super awesome and inspirational. Wulu uh, was a member of a server that we were both a part of. And he always talked about his VTuber stuff of uh, working towards uh, just constant streaming. Like, uh, not, what's the word? Uh, having the self-discipline to stream nearly uh, like five times a week at least. And I got really interested in that. And then he posted a link or like invited uh, Banui to the server. And I went on her server. I joined her community and I spent a lot of time actually watching uh, uh, watching her and interacting with the community. And because of that, I wanted to join that community, uh, which drove me to do all this. Everyone has their first VTuber that they're introduced to. Like I saw Coco from Hollow Live and a bunch of other the Hollow Live girls, but they all spoke Japanese. So it's like, hey, look at all these clips you can watch that people have subtitled. And the when they introduced their English branch, I watched Mori. I fell in love with the idea of VTubers, and I still I don't watch her as much nowadays, but I still listen to all of her music. She's great. Uh, Takahata, I started watching him in late November. Uh, and just seeing the community that he's built and like how like normally VTubers only exist in like one space by themselves and maybe do a collab every once in a while. I feel like he bridged the gap of just making a multiverse of VTubers. And I really I really enjoyed that and like made VTubers a bit more than just uh uh independent uh creatures. <laughs> And I would lastly like to thank Scarlet Lillian. She's in chat right now. Uh, she was the first person to comment on my Twitter stuff, and she was generally incredibly... Uh, thanks for following, TJ Jones. <laughs> she was incredibly welcoming to the community. Uh, and I believe that's the end of the slideshow. It's only been 20 minutes. Holy shit. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> what else are we planning today, guys? Uh, would you like to ask a few questions? Hey, yeah, yeah, Q&A. Let's do Q&A, everybody. Sorry, I'm, uh, I, I put it in the description that I giggle a lot, and I feel like that is coming. I giggle when I'm nervous. <laughs> there it is again. What are some of your favorite tabletop games aside from TTRPGs? Uh, 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 Catan. <laughs> <laughs> I am putting up a screen that uh, everyone, please cover your eyes for like five seconds. All right, three, two, one. I have these behind me the whole time. None of you knew. Can the void do a dancey dance? I'm going to do a dancey dance. Look at me go. But you see, it goes a bit slower when I'm sad. But then it goes faster when I'm happy. And it's just sort of midway when I'm neutral. Can I eat food? I can with my auxiliary tentacles that you cannot see. They're behind me. Squishy squid cyclops. <laughs> what other types of tentacles? Now you're getting into personal questions. <laughs> I don't know what we're doing anymore. <laughs> this is a very scuffed debut, and in a year's time, we're going to look back at it and cringe together. I will go, wee. Is there a horny eye? I, that did not make it through beta. Does the eyeball want to be friends? Of course, I want to be everyone's friend. I'll be your friend. Look what I can do. <laughs> hey, chat. Hey, do you want to hug chat? Chat. Don't run away, chat. There's no escape, chat. You know how people have a 
name for their fan base. You are all my pupils. There will be no argument. You are all my pupils. What the floated eyeball doing? Can I play League of Legends? Uh, um. <laughs> yes, I could. I could indeed play League. But, 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 it's a terrible game. That's all I have to say about that. Anyways, I am going to end the stream here. <laughs> uh, it looks like I have run out of time. The void is the end and the beginning, so it seems fair. Uh, I'm just gonna press. I'm gonna press the end stream button if you're okay with that. Uh, thank you everyone for joining me, and uh, I will see you tomorrow. Yes. Thank you. Hey, bye-bye.